Hey guys, in today's video we're going to talk about deodorant. Yes, deodorant. Something that's going to be very important if the shit ever hits the fan. Stick around. Hello YouTube and Google Plus people. First of all, if you've clicked on this video, it's probably a little bit more out of curiosity more than anything. And I know it's a little weird of a subject, but I think hygiene overall is important. Uh, definitely during an SHTF type situation, hygiene is going to be paramount as far as keeping clean, keeping hands clean, uh, fighting disease, um, and all of those things that come with not having running water or hot water these can all present problems so <clears throat> I just wanted to do a video because I feel that recently I've been experimenting uh, probably uh, in the beginning of summer of this year I started experimenting with some different deodorants and normally I had uh, always worn speed stick and I always wear deodorants not antiperspirants and I don't like the um, the white powdery stuff um, but my opinion has changed on that recently and then my <clears throat> my first choice was always Old Spice always had the best luck with Old Spice um, and being a bigger guy you know I've never had a situation with um, having excessive sweating under my arms I mean when I'm hot and overheated believe me I sweat a lot especially from my head if I'm out cutting the grass in July or August and the humidity here in the mid-Atlantic area um, it, it, it's it's pretty thick so <clears throat> these deodorants overall would last me a good eight hour day okay these two deodorants would get me through the day now these two deodorants which I've recently started trying and both of these I ordered off of Amazon one is called Jungle Man um, kind of a weird name I know and another thing with this is that these are all natural deodorants I guess with these deodorants that you kind of find in the, the everyday stores they contain a high um, content of aluminum and evidently a lot of people uh, don't like the aluminum and I think it's been linked to certain types of cancers and Alzheimer's all, all different kind of diseases um, and believe me guys I am not a all-natural kind of guy I'm just a good old boy here in Maryland and I'm not all about the all-natural products and I don't normally don't think that they work but these two products especially this one this now solutions this product right here now it says um, it's lavender and it definitely has a lavender uh, scent to it I uh, would have you guys look this product up on Amazon and check out the reviews now <clears throat> these products deodorant is a big personal preference what works for me may not work for you both of these are the chalk paste type deodorants okay and <clears throat> I normally do not like them because they leave white residue and streaks and all kinds of stuff especially if you wear darker clothing but I will tell you that the jungle man um, really doesn't leave hardly any residue at all the now does leave a little bit of residue and I only find it to be uh, more prevalent when it's humid outside and I think that this product here is more clumpy uh, when it's humid but when it's dry and like it is now here in the winter actually it's not officially winter yet but when it's more dry here I find that this is less clumpy now this deodorant um, if you read the reviews many people can wear this deodorant for several days um, and not have to reapply it I have found but I shower every day so um, but there was a point where I wasn't showering every day because I had surgery on my foot and I was non-weight-bearing and I couldn't get up to 
the third floor of my house to get to the full bathroom to take a bath or a shower. And uh, so there was a point where I wasn't showering every day. I was showering maybe every third or fourth day, and I was cleaning up every day. Um, anyway, that's kind of a moot point. But even the days where I wasn't showering every day, this deodorant and this deodorant lasted for me. If you shower every day, you really don't need to reapply this product. You can, however, and it will last you a 24-hour period. I guarantee it will. At least it for it did did for me. Again, it, this may not. I can't guarantee it'll work for you because everybody's different. But this definitely worked for me, and this definitely worked for me. So I think in a SHTF type situ situation where people are overexerting themselves, because let's face it, in any type of emergency situation, you're burning more calories. You're trying to figure out ways to get power to your home, uh, water, food, uh, shelter, whatever the situation is, you are definitely going to exert more energy. And I think a lot of people underestimate that. There's a lot of great videos going around right now from other channels talking about the uh, caloric intake and everybody saying, uh, you know, the norm is 1,500 to 2,000 calories a day per person. But in actuality, if you're doing work and labor and you're cutting wood and doing other things, you are going to burn through those calories b before lunchtime. Um, so you're looking at a minimum of 4,000 to 4,500 calories a day. But that's a whole different video, and there's a lot of different videos that were recently uploaded about that um, situation. But anyway, you're going to be exerting more energy and you're going to be burning more calories. You're going to be sweating more. No doubt. These products, I think, even though they're all natural, look them up on Amazon, read the reviews. I have um, found that these products actually work very, very well. Very surprising to me because they are all natural. There are a lot of videos on YouTube as well about making your own deodorants and uh, adding your own oils and things. Even though this has a lavender scent, I will tell you that it dissipates very quickly. When you put it on, you can smell the lavender, but it basically d disappears very quickly. Um, at least it does on me. Uh, you know, it may smell different on you, um, but I would definitely check these out. Uh, I think it's something that if you're going to be working real hard, you're going to be sweating, you're going to be stinky. And if you can't shower every day or you can only clean yourself to a limited amount due to hot water or whatever the situation is, then having a really good deodorant that lasts just makes sense. Not a lot more I can say about it, guys. I just wanted to share this video because I thought it was important. Hygiene overall, I'm not even talking about teeth and, and uh, you know, cleaning all, all the different parts of your body, but this will keep you from stinking, which I think if you're trying to build a community and you're trying to talk to your neighbors or whatever the case may be, at least you won't be offensive. Thanks for uh, watching, guys. As always, if you're not into preparedness, you're preparing to fail. Thanks for your time. Mm -hmm.